Stella McCartney is releasing 3,500 pounds replicas of Meghan's wedding reception gown, but only 46 lucky customers will be able to get hold of one. The British brand has announced that it will be selling a limited number of the halter neck gown following the royal wedding. Half of the collection will be lily white, like Meghan's dress, while half will be a classy onyx black. However, the dresses will only be available to view by private appointment, and only clients who have received a personal reply from McCartney will be able to see the gowns. The exclusive Made With Love collection is being launched to coincide with the opening of McCartney's new global flagship store on Old Bond Street. Speaking to Vogue, McCartney explained, I knew when I was working on the dress with Meghan that it was beautiful. I knew it would be a dress that people would want, and, in that moment, you can think, nobody can have it. Or you can share it. It's a very Stella McCartney dress, so it didn't feel like I was cheating anyone or not being us. McCartney had previously spoken of her pride at make the stunning halter neck dress for the evening reception at Frogmore House, calling the commission a big deal. Speaking to the BBC, McCartney explained she was determined to get it right because the wedding reception would be Meghan's final appearance before taking on her very austere, very serious royal role as the Duchess of Sussex. The show-stopping white halter neck gown was the last moment that Meghan, 36, could reflect the human within her, McCartney added. The British designer said, It was very much her dress, and I felt very proud that she came to me for that part of the wedding, and that she got to reflect, herself, in it. When asked whether the Duchess had approached her with ideas, the 46-year-old replied, Yeah, we worked together. When you come to a wedding you don't just go, here this is what you're wearing. That person has to feel like a million dollars they need to feel like they own it. She added, the role that she's taken on is very austere, it's very serious and I think there's a great weight that she has acquired though that and I think she takes it very seriously. I think it was the last moment that she could reflect, sort of the other side to her and, you know, the joy, and the human within her. I was aware that we had to get the right positioning, the right pace the right voice. There was a delicate line. When asked whether she was disappointed at not being invited to the wedding, the designer laughed, I'm not answering that question, that's ridiculous. McCartney first spoke of her pride at designing the dress in an interview with WWD the day after the wedding. She said, I am so proud and honored to have been chosen by the Duchess of Sussex to make her evening gown and represent British design. It has truly been one of the most humbling moments of my career and I am so proud of all the team on this stunning sunny royal day. While the neckline was modest, the backless number allowed Meghan to show off her toned shoulders and back, while the figure-hugging gown featured a dramatic fluted skirt. Celebrity stylist Lucas Armitage told Female that such a gown would probably cost around £80,000 for fabric, design and fittings.